Hello and welcome to Think and Drive. Here we have two exponential equations 2 power x times 3 power y equal to 12 and 2 power y times 3 power x equal to 18. So let's see how to solve this problem. Since these are the two exponential equations, so our target is to find the relationship between x and y. So for that, let's make this equation number first and this as equation number second. So in the first step, in step number first, we'll multiply equation first and equation second, that is multiply first into two. That is, we can write 2 power x into 3 power y into 2 power y into 3 power x equal to 12 times 18. Or we can rewrite this as 2 power x into 2 power y into 3 power x into 3 power y equal to 12 times 18. Now look here, we have same basis with different exponents. So we are going to use a formula that is a power m times a power n equal to a power m plus n. So this equation will become 2 power x plus y. Similarly, this 3 power x into 3 power y can be written as 3 power x plus y equal to 12 times 18. Now here we have same exponents with different bases. So we are going to use another formula that is a power m times b power m equal to a times b power m. So this equation will become 2 times 3 x plus y equal to 12 times 18. This 2 times 3 is 6. So this is 6 power x plus y equal to 12 times 18. Now we will break these numbers in factors. So this 12 can be written as 6 times 2 and similarly this 18 can be written as 6 times 3. So this is 6 power x plus y. The 6 power x plus y is equal to, now this is 6 into 6 and 2 times 3 is again 6. So this is, so this is 6 power 3 because we have 3 times 6. Now on the both sides we have same basis so powers will be equal that is this x plus y will be equal to 3. Let's make this equation number third. Uh, since we have to find the values of x and y, so for that we'll divide equation first and equation second. So in the step second, let's divide equation first and equation second. That is 2 power x times 3 power y over 2 power y times 3 power x equal to 12 divided by 18. Or we can write this as 2 power x over 2 power y times 3 power y over 3 power x equal to 12 and 18 have same factor that is 6. So we'll cancel out 6. So here remains 2 over 3. Now this 2 power x divided by 2 power y is of the form a power m divided by a power n. So we'll apply formula here that is a power m over a power n is equal to a power m minus n. So this will become 2 power x minus y into we can write this as 1 by 3 power x minus y equal to 2 over 3. That is 2 power x minus y over 3 power x minus y equal to 2 power 3. So this can be further written as 2 over 3 
whole power x minus y equal to 2 by 3. Why? Because we know a power m over b power m is equal to a by b whole power m. So that's why we have write this. Or we can write this as this is we have exponent 1 here. Now, now on the both sides, bases are same. That means x minus y is equal to 1. Let's make equation number fourth. So from third, equation third was x, x plus y equal to 3. And this equation fourth is x minus y equal to 1. Now if we add these two equations, we'll get 2x equal to 4. That means x is equal to 2. And if we subtract these two equations, we'll get 2y equal to 2. That is y equal to 1. So this is our final result. So don't forget to like, comment and share and subscribe our channel for more videos. We'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care and bye bye.